Hello, my name is Thomas. I will be bringing to you some crafts that we are going to do today. We'll do two snowflakes differently. We will be doing a candy cane, a tree, and a snowman. We'll start off with our first snowflake. For the snow first snowflake, you will need four ow, four <laughs> four of any size a popsicle stick and you will need a hot glue gun of, or any uh, glue of any sort. I just like to use hot glue gun but I don't know why I keep burning myself with it. But how we're going to start out is you're going to put these two together like an X. You just put a drop right there. Not too much but just a little tad. And you will stick them two together. <coughs> then, on top of that, on whatever side, oh, hold still, I need some hot glue. For your uh, one side, just dab it again. This time, on the outside of the ducts, you're going to put it up for the first one. And then, right after you do that, kind of let the hot glue a little. Then that facing up on the opposite side you're going to want to place it sideways. Just a little sideways. Like so. And that will be your first snowflake. If you choose, you can paint it. I've made these before and my sister has painted them. But, we're going to move straight on to our second snowflake. Alright, for our second snowflake, you'll need four Q-tips. You're going to do almost the same thing. Almost exactly the same thing. Thing is, this, you have to be good with a hot glue gun to do. Like so. I would hold it there for a few seconds just because in between it's a lot tinier of a spot doing Q-tips than doing popsicle stilts. So it's just a little difficulter. And while we're at it, don't forget to like and subscribe if you like my channel or if you like in general doing ow <laughs> or if you just in general like doing crafts like and subscribe it would really help me out I am new to this YouTube but next we will be making a snowman all together You'll need at least three, but I'm just for the heck of it, I'm going to do four for the bottom. Then we're going to do a three, and then we're going to do a one. That's just how I'm doing it. What you're going to want to do is make a, them four into a big one, and hot glue it together to a certain extent. To best your capabilities, because it is very, very soft. But, after that, you're just going to take your three, you're going to do the same thing. Clump them together, and hot glue them together. Then, you're going to put them in, like so. Ow, ow, hot glue, ow. This hot glue gun's going to become my arch nemesis. Then, right here, you're just going to go so. Stick your last one on. Now, somewhat of a snowman. The best of my capabilities for a snowman. Because a snowman is quite difficult. Now, I, I would say the easiest. You don't need a hot glue gun for the, this next one. It's really easy. All you need to go is go to the dollar store, buy some pipe cleaner. But all you need... There's one red and one white pipe cleaner. We're going to make a candy cane. 
like so, here or there. All you gotta do to start it off is you tie these two together around a few times to make sure it's nice and connected. Then you stick your finger in there, twist, like so. And you make it all into one pipe cleaner, like so. And you wrap that white around to end it. Then you got yourself one stripe pipe cleaner. Then all you gotta do is make it into a candy cane. Like so. That's all you need for that. Now I would say the hardest one Next, I will be showing you how to make a tree. To make a tree, I took a piece of fabric of some sort. Don't ask me exactly what type of fabric. I found it in the art supplies. But, I just simply clipped this handmade. And I tried my best. But I'll, you'll need some beads, any color. I just, I'm going to do random. And any color pipe cleaner. So to start this, you're going to shove this through your pipe cleaner. I mean, your pipe cleaner through the fabric. And it's up to you. You can just knot it however you wish. But what I seem to like to do, is since I like to hang mine, I am going to do this. Like so. So in the end, it's going to be like this. And... Here's one I made, but the felt or er, fabric was already done. This is me doing it. Let's open up our jar of beads. I think this is the first time I've worked with beads in uh, quite a while. But we'll just slide that on there, make that nice and snug. Then we'll slide that on there. Make that nice and snug, like so. I mean, look at that. Then, carefully, you will grab another bead. And you'll lay it, like so. Then you'll put it through the fabric again. And it'll automatically do that. This is a good sign. But I'm just gonna lay a few. Oops, I lost one. Lay a few in my cap here. Dang it, I lost another one. I'll lay a few in my cap. And I will quickly do this. Just if you wish, you can pause the video. But I'm going to try as quick as possible to get this done. <sighs> it's a lengthy step but at most it's took me about five minutes to do all right now we got a small itty bitty tree like I said it didn't work out very well but the small itty bitty tree now what we're gonna do is I have either put three or two on the bottom today I'll just do two then of some sort, I hope this is too long, but what you want to do is, oh, thank you. What you want to do is just kind of like weave this up and around to make sure the beads ain't coming off anytime soon. I just kind of like clench it a few times, like so. So you still have that under. Then, like I do, I go hang it on a tree. 
But before we stop, I just thought of something. Your snowman's missing some eyes. Another add on that you could do is put some eyes on. But I'm just going to quickly do that just for the heck of it. Because I do, do use these rec wrap decorations when I'm done. So, what the heck, I'll toss some eyes on there. Ouch. Hurt myself again. Ow. <sighs> there. Then, there is the five things. The two snowflakes, the snowman, the candy cane, and the tree. And on like Looney Tunes, most people would say, that's all folks. But here's something else. The like and subscribe rabbit says to please like and subscribe to my channel. And like Looney Tunes says, that's all folks.